Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Captain Encrypted and we are back with more Endzone. With the Rome wasn't built in a day scenario, I believe episode 4. So let's see where we left off. I remember we had a bit of an interesting crisis the last time. So we've been expanding our rainwater collectors, food station and the shelter, trying to cut down on all the transit. Uh, we are trading a bit of scrap to get some knowledge and electronics, that's okay. Uh, we unlocked the mine, which we are trying to build. Do we have any outstanding stuff? We don't have any missions. We are okay on radiation protection and tools just for now. We definitely need more wood and scrap, and I'll definitely need more herbs. And we're really struggling on coal. So let's see, did we address that? So our workshop cannot run because it needs uh, metal plates, scrap and wood, which we don't have any. We built a pasture with goats to help with the food. We're building a well to give ourselves a bit of water. Campfire to fix morale. Uh, and we are kind of low on people. Oh yes, and we did build some farms to help with the food crisis. Also, we have a bit of contaminated food here. And this is our second charcoal kiln. But for that, we need wood. Did I... I haven't put a gather wood thing somewhere. Which we will probably have to do so we can get on top of that. Let's start with that. Okay. Let's unpause the game. Let's go on speed 2. And we'll speed up in a moment. Just to give things a moment to actually happen. And we have buildings to repair. What are we missing? Wood. A lot of wood. So that should be one of our priorities. Try to get that wood back into an acceptable level. Research station. We were researching wind turbines. Okay, so a bit of electricity will help with productivity too. So that's excellent. No points of interest here, which is okay. I have gathered our resources down here for some herbs and everything else. That's okay. Ooh, we need a lot of repairs. And we only have one poor person doing it all. Fun, fun, fun. Ah, yeah, and it's time for the death wave. And we have an epidemic. Cool. Yep, that, uh, that's a lot of people on the street. So, how can we tackle that? We are about to get a drought, so we're going to get some people available. I think I just need to wait for a moment for uh, some workforce. Let's go full speed. Okay, we have exactly... Okay, so everything we get, it, it's been reserved to repair things. That's understandable. A few more shelters. Settlers. I will give them one more mortician. Just so we can start collecting all those corpses. And I definitely need to prioritize building the forum. Because the missions from this will help a lot with resources. Ideally, in the game, you want to try to get this as soon as possible. Wood station, just one person will be enough for you when we get to it. The key question is, do I have enough water? Okay, so I need about 3,000, so I will probably barely make it, in terms of water. What is this one missing? Wood. Surprise, surprise. 
Research is done. Good. I'm gonna hold off on that. They can keep gathering knowledge. You are missing coal. Yep. But wood is slowly going up, so I'm happy about that. Okay, hunting lodge and gatherer's ha cabin will be repaired next. Ooh. No, don't break the jetty. I got a lot of snowstorms. Repair. Actually, no. Keep building. I'll give you a couple more people to do the repairs faster. And we are still collecting people from all over the place. You're just waiting for someone to go build. Okay, that should be okay. Yeah, so we need a, roughly about 4,000 to survive a day. Manageable. Not the easiest, but manageable. I do not want you to use rainwater. Rainwater bad for that. That's fine. All types of food. We don't have much of a choice currently. You're hunting for all types of animals. Yes. Oh, we have a visitor. <coughs> hey, if that isn't my absolute favorite customer, sure it is. Have faith in old Tibera. She knows them all. Once again, Tibera's got only her very best of a lot. <coughs> Take your sweet time. Tibera's got to quiet down her lungs. Again. <laughs> Again. I'm gonna get the tools. They might not be the best tools, but we definitely need some tools until we can catch up. <coughs> Are you mad at old Tibara? No. I'm just asking. Should I bring something special along for you again next time? How about a little kiss? No. I'll pass on the keys, lady. But bring me some goods and we'll do business. Hmm, I can upgrade this to a town hall quite soon, but not yet. I want to finish with all of these buildings and I'll need to start investigating these locations. Too much to do, too little time. Um... Why do I have nine logisticians? Is it because of this one? Yes. So you go down to three. You don't need more for now. I will bump up all the logisticians so they can fill this stuff up. The mine is on hold. That's okay. I don't need it immediately. It'll probably be a while until we have raiders again. One person on the well, which I need to build now. Just so we can get a little bit of passive water income. Well, passive. It's not exactly passive, but... We got all that. We did. Uh, let's cut this stuff out. So you guys are on 200 a season, which is a lot. But even when it's dry, that remains tolerable. So yeah. We won't be able to get away with having it on low. What I'm really worried about is the radiation. Because people are going to get really, really sick with all this radiation. Production is empty. What production is empty? You. You picked up everything. Okay. Uh, that's a nice location. A bit far, but nice. That's another nice location, and that's what we're going to work on. Plus a couple points of interest. Oh, here we go. Forum. Ah, I missed it. Yeah. Let's do the dead, boys on our dead bodies on our street. Tom, more and more dead bodies are accumulating on our streets. If you really ought to see 
to it that we give these poor souls a place where they can rest in peace. You got it. So all of this wants is just to assign one more person since the game is like, clearly you don't have enough people to do it. So there you go. That's an easy win. And if anything, I'm just gonna bump it all up so we can gather the bodies quickly. Yep, you can see all the paths all over the place. That's okay, I just want to get a little bit of rap with you, bye-bye. I don't need anything you have at the moment, we're good. Okay, we're collecting all of that. But we have unexpected opportunity. Ah, faced. They want to increase their morale, I don't have that much food. Um, We're going to do one of that. So, step one, we want 200 wild meat which is fine it's gonna be too hard ah, actually we can get it from our goats too uh you want us to gather plants and produce some herbs easy peasy so let's place you here so we just need to wait for some herbs to be collected to get to the next uh one and i think from memory this will give us a seed of something and seeds are very handy they really make or break um, a game. Any more bodies anywhere that... Nope, we're good. Cool. What are they collecting? Ah, just gathering. Okay, Morticians down to one. I don't need more for now. The death wave is done. And we want to try to chase as many of those blue ones we can. Water looks okay. Population is constant, which is good. I'm not building any more housing for now. Yep. Trying to balance the economy. What do you find? So you want me to store water and create more plastic. I should be able to do that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put a couple more people as water carriers. And that should push us over the 9000. I'll wait for the plastic and if I see I don't get it, I might uh, utilize another trick. Actually, it will rain, so those should fill up. Ooh, water went down. No, we want more water. You're full. You're not full. Why are you not full? What's wrong with you? That's why you're not full. Well, truth be told, need more water anyway. So... Let's do another water tower. Ah, actually, no one is collecting this, is it? Yes. Okay. So I want a water tower closer to this segment, I think. And it doesn't give a negative mood. So that's... That's a good thing. So I'm gonna place you right about here. I'm gonna prioritize you. Oh, it's an oncoming drought. Hmm, <laughs> buffalo. While I do want the buffalo, I also want the water. Once again, Tibera's got only her very best of a lot. Yeah, that will be too expensive. Take your sweet time. Tibera's got to quiet down her lungs. <laughs> yeah, 500 water, you can have that. I can afford that. Come on, water, go up. And I want this close to the Zeti and this. I have the people, so everyone, go, go, go. It's 
still really low on lumber. And we have a few sick people too. I could totally pass a law to, to make them ratio water, but it will give them a big impact on their morale, and I don't want to go down that path. No new bodies? We're still good? We're still good. Come on, we're almost there. Come on. Why am I, Where do I need 13 farmers and why? So I have those as two, 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 two. Ah, uh, sure, take the people. Coal, we barely have enough. Ooh, we hit the production limit. No, 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 no. No limits. Keep making stuff. Yep, we got the water. Now we need to wait for a little bit of plastic. Take one more scrap collector. Everything else is topped up. More herbalists. Yes, we want a bit of excess. Because I can trade those. And trading those is good. Okay, we're good. You cost me a little... Oh, bell pepper. Nice. We've been back on the surface again for quite a while now, Chief. All of us were born up here. Although without the first settlers, who still came from the engine, we never would have made it here. Some of our settlers came up with an idea to put up a monument to those settlers so that we never forget where they all come from. Okay. Let's build a pioneer statue, which will make people very, very happy. Plus 15. Where do I want you? So, if I put you here, you're gonna counteract all of those. I have nothing here, but I don't really want a monument there. Ah, decorations, decorations. Um, this will only give you a little bit. Here it would make a massive difference, but I'm thinking I'll need more people at some point. And I will probably have those people on this side. So... We're going to keep... Actually, can I make you so you get all of that? Let's place you here. And let's do a little bit of testing. Okay, one, le one more to the left. So, cancel. Up. No. No. Here. And now, I want that decoration to cover all of this side. Ah, right here will do, right in the middle. There will be no path. If I go one tick here and down here, that should be exactly in the middle and it should work like a little plaza. Cool. So, cancel, cancel. I don't want to build those yet. But I measured to make sure that those are not there. <coughs> hey, if that isn't my absolute favorite customer, sure it is. Have faith in old T. Barra. She knows them all. Once again, T. Barra's got only her very best of a lot. <coughs> Take your sweet time. t bear has got to quiet down her lungs again. You got it, girl. <laughs> Give me the beans. Got the wood from here. Need more wood. So let's cut that stuff up. Wood is looking really good. And water is looking significantly better. Next, bottleneck population. So it's about time we expand the population a little bit. But first, wood. So there's this forest tree, which we have with cut down and everything. So I want you to do this. People are effectiveness. 
How much of a buffer do I have after a death wave? That's, my, that's the key question. Plus, power will make them happier, so they will live longer. So I think power is definitely the way to go. But power is pricey. Very pricey. Oh, look, repairs. Hooray! Oh, and we almost have five of these. Okay, uh, got a plan, plan, plan. Definitely want a refinery. They're awfully expensive. Warehouses are good, but also seriously expensive. We got the power. That's good. Weather station. Eh, not really in a rush. We need 10 technologies to unlock prosperity. And we don't have hemp here. We don't have... Uh, what do you call it? I think it's called hemp. To actually plant it and create cloth that way. So I'm going to go with refinery. Going to be super expensive, but it will be worth it because it will replace our um, refineries. Recyclers. We'll take more people, but we'll be super more productive. And it won't fit over here, so it will have to go probably on this side. And I think it's about time I also build... They are very happy, excellent, make them even happier. Solid foundation, confidence, eh, those are tricky. Not at the moment. I'll pick my battles, for now. Expedition station, that's what we really, really need. Oh, you would fit here so nicely. Oh well. But you do fit here. So, I can take the gather plants away. I can just put it over there, it doesn't matter. Not like I'm utilizing it currently. I can place you here. Yep. Hi, Tibara. Corn. Girl, you're on fire. Once again, Tibera's got only her very best of a lot. <coughs> Take your sweet. <laughs> I got it. You got it. We good. Bunch of repairs to do again. Now, I wanted to look at power and what this whole thing will cost. So, one electric pole is six wood, six scrap, three plates, and three electronics. Yeah, this is going to get expensive very fast. Wind turbine, 12, 12, 6, and 6. And I will need to see how much power I need. Why is this inactive? Because I never fixed it, that's why. Okay. Uh, we haven't hit a food limit yet, that's okay. The contamination posture, it covers all of that, but it doesn't cover this area here. Which is a slightly bit of a problem. Also, you're missing a person, there you go. Mm, I have no way of capturing that. But it's only those 40, so that's not too bad. Why are you radiated? You should not be radiated. You have those to prevent that. Did you run out of water? No. Ah, it just takes time to disperse. Okay. I can live with that. Epidemic. Uncertain reward. The consequences of these missions are uncertain. They might include valuable rewards, such as additional settlers, buildings, or special rewards like seeds, knowledge, or new technologies. Well... I don't really have resources to play around with, but you know what? Let's do it. Our doctors are experimenting with a new type of medicine. I'm supposed to ask you on their behalf if we're able to provide them with more material for the research, okay? You want medicine? Okay. That's fine. Go for it. Here, take people. Build it faster.
That's not too bad. And this is getting there. Good, good, good. This is definitely a priority. Uh, where it's a thousand, I... Unlike all the other settlements at that time, it was supposed to be last. Today, 75 years later, this city still stands, even when you and my father have long since ceased to walk upon this earth anymore. And, as a tribute to him, we defy all the adversities and obstacles that life places in our way. My father founded this city and helped it to undreamt of size and stability. I shall perpetuate the memory of him and keep this city, along with its inhabitants, alive, whatever the cost. Let's do it. Hey, I hope the sleazy settlement has stuff I can do something with. At any rate, it's your lucky day because Lizzie Ross knows that's precisely what you pitiful little ones are looking for. Lizzie Rasmus, are you related to the band Rasmus? Yeah, water is solid. Let's look at the pioneer statue. They all look happy to see him. What are you guys doing there? You're idle. Why do I have idle people? My colonies never have idle people. Ah, we have a bit of a thing. Okay, so we want to cut more wood. Go cut that. Uh, we hit a production limit on milk. Take one person here. Uh, so, I wonder if the trading post is influenced on what it allows me to trade based on what's nearby it. So, I get a lot of mushrooms to trade and they are stored here. You're not giving me the medicine, but do I not store medicine up here? No. Oh yeah, I do. A thousand. I'm sure it depends on the merchant as well, but... I want to try something. I want to try to put a storage closer to this. And see how it's going to influence it. They can build it whenever there is no RAS. Few more medicine. Great, they have strange symptoms. Now you want herbs, okay? Which means I actually need to increase the available stock, otherwise they will not collect it. And that's a tricky thing with this game. But that's okay. I can live with that. Now, I want to scan the scout this, so I'll send the scout here. And hopefully it will have some seeds or technology or something. Yeah, you will get there eventually. Twelve people. 
No bodies on the street. Good, good. Uh, go cut that stuff down. And then pause this. Might as well build it. But we are definitely ready to increase our population. I wish you a lovely day. I'm glad to be able to be back here again. I've packed a whole range of um, super awesome things for you. I really Let's see if you're interested in something. See, the thing is, I don't really need any of them. So bye bye. See you soon. Oh, great. They're all getting sick. Uh, a storage depot run. Hey, Chief. It's your favorite scout. I came across the ruins of an old storage depot on my foray out here. More or less caved in, but there still ought to be some scrap to salvage. I just spotted something. There are two sealed containers standing behind the ruin. They probably haven't been looted yet. So I need an expert at charcoal and everyone needs to have metal tools. Okay? Let's do that. So... Mateo, you are the guy. You will take Emma, Elizabeth, Lauren, Bobby, and Raymond with you. You will get metal tools. And you will take food. You will take uh, four. I'll go with ten action points just to be safe. And since they will not have enough, I'll just give them a few more people to produce them. And it's auto save time. Ah, uh, of course, now they want protective suits. Th 13 radiation suits. Really, guys? Really? How long do I have? Five seasons. Oof. Yeah, the coal struggle is real. I really need a solution for coal. Well, I can mine it at some point, but I don't think I can mine it yet. Yeah, so people are gathering so they can go do their thing. One thing to be careful about here is, if you send someone very old and they don't go start the mission, it can cancel the whole mission if they die. So it's just something to be a bit cautious about. I wish you a lovely day. I'm glad to be able to be back here again. I've packed a whole range of, um, super awesome things for you. Take a look and see if you're interested in something. You can get the medicine. I got a bunch of it and I need to make more. There you go. And I need the radiation suits too, so yes. Oh, raiders. Of course. Anybody else? <laughs> well, they won't appear anytime soon. They'll probably take like another 10-15 seasons, so probably around 100, I think. Antidote, cool. We have that, we're fine. And I really don't want to keep making radiation suits because I cannot afford them. Okay, so that's done. That body's on the street. Take one more mortician. Good, they're happy again. Very happy, actually. Compared to the other ruins, this one's pretty much a wreck. The whole depot will probably collapse the next time a severe storm comes along. Watch out that none of those metal struts falls on your heads. We could have put some thought into protective gear, but who would think you'd need helmets in the post-apocalypse? Everyone? Also, is that the guy on the um, forklift? Yes. <laughs> There's apparently not much to salvage here, except it's crap and containers.
Achievement. Mayor's high eight. <laughs> I obtain, okay. Cool, positive effect, nice. Call! Well, thank you, sir. Loot and return. Bring it all back. Adios! And when they come back, we can take down this storage depot. Yeah, the only problem we're really struggling with coal is we don't have enough wood production. We got a bit of a cheesy way to deal with that, actually. Going to make a few cabins. And with a few, I mean a lot. That is definitely a start. Let's build a road here and a road here. Let's build you here and that's smaller. That's okay, one is enough. Here, take this. One for five beers, you got it. Bye. Five chosen people will have beer. We were conducted by several explorers from another settlement. They are on their way back from an expedition and they want races. They will be willing to trade some of the stuff they found. Cool. Take this. And some of my food. Oh, a seed. Oh, squash. Nice. Now, I don't need 10 people here. Actually, it doesn't hurt, so yes, they can stay. Foresters I definitely need to max out. I'm really struggling with wood. So, what we're going to do is we're going to salvage that and start scouting things. That way we can get information about those points of interest. Uh, you want to make more medicine? Make more medicine, go up to a thousand. And we have a bunch of scrap here that needs to be removed. How are you going? You almost cleaned this up, that's good. We got the refinery. Coal mining is what I really, really want. Let's go warehouses. More wood. Hooray! Feast. Yes. There you go. I have resources, so I might as well give it to you, right? Uh, that's a construction site. It's a bit far. Lots of steel containers and a big plot of land. Bring all the tools and being careful. Standing for a while, it could collapse. You know, metal tools and someone with a refiner buds. I don't have anyone with a refiner buds, right? Oh, I do. Okay. Then I'll just send this crew. I'll give them 10 action points with metal tools and send them. And see what this is about. General store. No, we'll check that after, one at a time. We cannot have more expeditions, unfortunately. Greenhouse, that will be good. Usually has herbs and stuff. Well, seeds, not herbs. Change tomatoes for corn. 
One more food variety. And schedule type of research. Sure. Take my resources. A lot of them. And you gave me one research point. I can live with that. Anything else from me? No. Look at them. They are super happy. Ah. I will be easy to pick up. Just a bit of loot. Building the housing. I wish you a lovely day. I'm glad to be able to be back here again. I've packed a whole range of uh, super awesome things for you. Take a look and see if you're interested in something. See, I don't really need any. Besides the tools, I can get the tools and trade with some protection. Okay, let me be a bit more greedy then. Here, take one of this. That would be a Thank you. Of course, work-related accident. My tailor is broken. 13 scrap. Are we there yet? Oh, there is a point of interest here. Oh, that's a general store. Okay. That will be the next thing to scout. I mean, we scouted already, but actually go pick up what's there. Do I have any more scouts I can send out? Yes, I do. Go guys, scout it all. We need to find the technology. Our researchers want to try a new technology. They want transfer knowledge transfer decree. Okay. After this, we can do that. More happiness. Yep, we have no housing. Good, 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 good. Which is exactly what I wanted, so I can trigger a mission. We need to go phase two is 150 seasons, so that'll be a little while. Um, food production is there. Give me more food. Good. And now I want knowledge transfer, thank you. Let's scout it as well. Any more? Yep. Oh, hello. Yes, that's what I want. I want the hemp. Okay, so all of you just have resources. Good, I'll be easy. Now for scouts. Greetings from up here. Ole Sorensen is back in town again with some exotic delicacies waiting to be on From up here, okay. Here, have a beer on me. Goodbye. We've made it, Chief. I think this here was supposed to become a building at some point, but it was never completed. Man, this is really incredible. There's still equipment standing around that was used for construction. Apparently building materials and containers, too. The things in the back, I think they're old toilets from way back when. But we'd be better off not using them. I wonder why. Scrap, few pieces of resources, nothing exciting. More stuff, yeah, minimal resources. Uh, 
Wait, there's more? Oh, the toilets. You said do not look at the toilets. <laughs> well, apparently as a mean boss, I send them there. A few pieces of metal, and I want it all. Thanks. Water is fluctuating a little bit. Oh. Increase that limit. Increase the limit on electronics. Good. They are even happier now. Take more of my resources and give me more science. Because science is awesome. Uh, I can do two more without triggering the prosperity stuff. Uh... I definitely want the sturdy houses before I get into prosperity and coal mining. Yes, I'm going to hold off for the for now. And those are being very slowly built. Are you done? Oh, hello. All the scouts are all over the place. You finish? You did. Now go collect all of this stuff in here. Anything. You've got plenty. I can smell it. Yeah, smell it all the way here. Give it to me. I want all of it. Greed much? Here, take this. I'll give you five pieces of beer. Four of these. Not impressed yet? Okay. Can I give you water? Uh, you're expensive. You want 10,000 food? Okay. No, just the smell of bye bye. Uh, I know what I'm doing on the next mission. I mean, the next episode. Building more defenses because I had them enough. Plus, the economy is quite. Well stabilized now. What does uh, an old transfer cost? All uneducated objects are educated. The decree consumed two knowledge accumulated at the research station. So this would make all of my adults fully educated. How many do I have that are not educated? So population, education. Thirteen. I don't really have many. Uneducated. Hmm. I should probably increase the limit of milk. Well, milk is used later for stuff. Unfortunately, it's no longer a food, which is a bit of a bummer, but... Tel Aviv. Ole Sorensen lands once again Bitch. in this gorgeous oasis of culinary well-educated folks. Today, we have a whole range of treasured edible treats on offer, specially assorted just for you. You are expensive. You know that? Give me the seed. And this is where I'm going to end today's episode. Thanks everyone very much for watching. Don't forget to drop a comment, like, subscribe, you know, the usual stuff. Let me know what you think about the game, and I'll catch you all on the next one. Bye-bye.